The NWSL have released their kits for this season. And we were having a little chat uh, in the group earlier, weren't we, about the best kits um, and if we could possibly get them in the UK, um, what we would get and which team we could be adopting uh, for the next season to follow along. Um, so, Chloe, thoughts on this one? What, what do you think? Um, I Every year, I think the NWSL do amazing kits. Like, I'm an Orlando Pride fan. I've been a Pride fan for about oh, six years now. Like, ever since I got into women's football, Orlando Pride has been the American team that I kind of have adopted. And they have had a Luna kit for the past two years, which I just thought was so pretty. And they've got a new kit this year. They've got the classic purple, but they've also introduced a, like, a citrus kit, which has got oranges, the oranges... oranges. It's just covered in oranges <laughs> with like a little green stalk sticking out for the oranges of Orlando. And it, it looks quite cool, but it's also quite funny. It's just, it's just oranges. But... Just oranges. Yeah. <laughs> and it, it got to the point, I think someone was saying as well in the comments, they were like, why is it that if any other team dared to change their colours, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be okay? But the fact that Orlando applied have just gone, you know what? Oranges. Just oranges. Do that, yeah. <laughs> More fruit on kits, please. Yes, what are that's what we need to do as well. Which fruit should be on which kit in the WSL and championship? That'd be good. What is locally grown in each each of those cities? <laughs> um but, but yeah, Daddy, I don't know if you you'd had a look at any of these kits yet. Yeah, it's it's hands down the winner is uh, San Diego Wave for me, their kit is beautiful yes i love it it's it's just so different and it took me a couple of looks to 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 like fully take it in but it is like as an ensemble as well the kit really works really well um the i think all of the like what they're calling the secondary kits seem quite um similar um but this yeah. hope not first or home kit as you want to call it for um san diego is brilliant i love it it's, it's the standout for me it's like a geometric sunrise if mm. you squint, kind of, if you had 3D glasses on, it's a very, um, <laughs> it might give you a headache after a while. The <laughs> but yeah. beautifully, beautifully I get the feeling it's one of these kits that's going to look really good when you see it in person as well. What you see in pictures and, you know, all that kind of thing. Yeah. It looks good. But when you see it in person, I get the feeling it's going to be really nice in person. But So if you've got yeah, any San Diego please. fans watching that want to send across a shirt, um, <laughs> then I'll be yes. I'll be, Absolutely. Really and just one. put into perspective, uh, apologies to Nike for any copyright, but this is the kit in question. This is the geometric yes. sunrise for that one. Because um, I didn't even know what it was when I first looked at it. I was like, is it DNA? Is it what, <laughs> what, what, what is going on with this one? Then I think it's a sunset. Uh, <laughs> yeah. um, Rosie, I don't know if you had a chance to look at any, any of the kits. Did you have one that you quite liked? Yeah, I really like the Washington Spirit one. It's sort of like black and white, got some cool patterns on it. I don't know. I just think it's really cool. Um, yeah, yeah that was I like that they've got it out there, haven't they? Yeah, it was just different, like kind of cool. And yeah, I don't know. But I was disappointed by AFC because the first time in my life I can get a Gen B t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> not playing for us now. <laughs> but no, I think, again, it might look better on because at the moment it just looks like a white shirt. I think and then, yeah, it's white, and then the away kit's like just black, isn't it? Yeah, it's, so it's just so much. Oh, but haven't they called it like light and shadow, or like brightness and darkness, or something? Like they've got really like powerful names, and then you're like, it's white and black. <laughs> <laughs> um, I have to say, um, again, apologies to Nike for any copyright. Um, the racing Louisville one that looks like. It should be, I don't know, someone's granddad's jumper, maybe? It's like a jockey, jockey's top, isn't it? I was going to say that. Racing, yeah. like, the jockey, like the racing jockey one. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I, that was my favourite. <laughs> we'll put it on, we'll put like a little flat cap on as well, and then that's that might go quite nicely. Um, I have to say, I did quite like um, this blue one. The, this one was a bit of me. Yeah, that is nice. I can't remember. Is it, is it rain or is it North Carolina Courage? I'm not too sure. I'll have to double check. But yeah, I was like, North Carolina. Yeah, um, was it North Carolina Courage? Perfect. And even Chris has said in the chat, 
my adopted team is North Carolina Courage. So, so yeah, so watch this space for who we <laughs> who we support next.